Yeah, Governor Walls wants to extend those peacetime emergency powers because he says this COVID emergency is not over. His powers went into effect at the start of the pandemic. Each time he extends them, he's required to call back lawmakers for a special session so that there's opportunity to repeal. Walls says it's imperative that we have the tools necessary to respond to this public health emergency. Now, if this session is anything like previous months, then we can expect the Republican-controlled Senate to vote to strip his powers and the DFL-controlled House to let him keep them. Think about that Thanksgiving table when you were a kid. You always wanted to be at the adult table. Well, we're not even at the kitty table. We're like in the garage. Realistically saying it's over or saying that it's all done is not right. It's not. We all know it. We, we, we have hospital beds that are still filling. And that was from last month's special session. And in recent sessions, lawmakers have tried to uh, tackle other issues like a massive public infrastructure bill, but nothing has gone through. Governor Walz says today there could be a chance for that bonding bill you've been hearing about for months. But he says if nothing happens today, then it will likely be killed. Gia? All right, Kyle, we'll be listening in on this one. Well